new look today, so you have to let me know what you think. But, um, Ipsy came. It's Ipsy time. Okay, Ipsy's a $10 a month subscription. Subscription. We'll get through it, I promise. And, um, you get sample size products. You usually get a, a makeup, you always get some sort of a makeup bag. Um, and, yeah, let's see what we got. All right. The bag is pretty neat. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's very textured. I like it. It's almost like a leather feel. It's the same on both sides. And then it has the gold zipper. And on the poles, each one says Ipsy on it. I don't know if you'll be able to see that or not. We'll try. All right, let's open our bag and see what our first item is. There's some big, chunky stuff in here. Okay. Adesi, New York. Organic infused nail lacquer. Gel effect. I'm going to have to check this out. Oh, deception is the color. Let me hold this up where you can see it. Let's see if we can get it to focus on it and not my face. Okay, hopefully you guys are seeing it. Um, it's like a gray taupey color. Taupe. I don't know if that's the correct. It's very gray looking. Look at it. Oh, I like the color. Looks very thin, so probably going to have to have a couple coats, but I'll definitely try it out and let you guys know how it goes. Now, you guys know that I do do my nails with the Dollar Tree stick-on nails, but that is not going to stop me from painting over them when they start to look a little... Ugh. So, we'll definitely try that out, and I'll let you know how it goes. Okay. Oh, here's the card. Uh, theme this month is Like a Boss. And, um... Charlotte Cho, co-founder, Korean Skin Be Beauty Site. I guess might say, I'm a boss babe. This month's glam bag is all about being the strongest, most fearless version of you. Okay, that's the card. That's a picture of Charlotte Cho, who helped create this box, or this bag, sorry. Not the bag itself, but the contents of, helped inspire it. Ooh, what is this hefty? What's a hefty sample? Okay. Uh, supple preparation facial toner. 30 milligrams. 1.01 full ounces. That's really good size sample. And it is from Clarice. 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 Let me see. Can you see it? I think so. Okay, let's open it up and see what you got. It's really... Oh my goodness, look at the size of that. That's a really good size, especially for a toner. Supple Protection Facial Toner. Moisturizing Skin Care Program. Well, we're definitely going to have to check this out, and uh, I'll let you guys know how this one's going. That one's going to definitely be fun to try. Okay, what else do we got in here? Oh, got a little something here. What is this one? Uh, Elizabeth Mott Pop Goes the Shadow in Gunmetal. This is what the packaging looks like. And then this is what the shade gunmetal. I like that. Very pretty. Would definitely go with the look that I've got today. Let's swatch. Ooh, very soft. Very pigmented. I like that color. Definitely help bring out the blue in my eyes. Very. I like that. 
like that a lot. That's going to be fun. You guys need to pay attention to what's going on with my channel because I placed another Wish. Uh, a bunch of, I ordered a bunch of items off of Wish. And one of them I found a magnetic uh, Z palette. And we're going to try that out when I get it. Got a Luxie brush. Which... Let me pull it out of the package. I think are awesome little brushes. They're very soft. I've never had a problem with one that I've gotten. And this is the Luxie 207. And it's an angled shading brush. Uh, let's see if I can get it in there so you can see it. You can't see Luxie. I guess it would help if it said, if you find where it says it. There we go. Luxie brush. Can't see the brush. There we go. Very nice. Very soft. And I'm starting to get quite a collection of these brushes, which makes me excited. Because I love me some good brushes. Okay, we have one more thing in here, and it is... Uh, from Beauty For Real. I don't think I've ever heard of that one, but... 24-7 eyeliner, and it is in, what shade are you in? Champagne Buzz. Let's open it up. <gasps> it just broke, guys. The whole tip just broke off, and it is not moving. I got a defective, oh, it's moving a little bit. It's moving a little bit. Okay, let's see if we can swatch it. It's very soft. Very shiny. Very Definitely a highlighter. I would call that a highlighter more than I would a eyeliner. I mean, maybe in the inner corner or in the waterline, maybe. Should we try it in the waterline? This is not going to be pretty, people. Okay. Let's give it a try. I'm going to get all up in your face. Use my mirror here. It says it's 24-7. We'll see. It's not wanting to even go in my eye, I don't think. Oh, it did a little bit. Let's try it in the inner corner. I think that's going to be the best place for this. Okay. That's the eye with it, and that's the eye without it. You really don't see it much, do you? You really got to put a lot on there for it to show. So, I don't know. It's a little bit better. And then, under the eyebrow, maybe? Mm, I don't know, guys. I don't know if I'm happy with it. I've already got highlighter on the cupid's bow okay but it is turning up i'm gonna have to find that oh it's not going down once it's up it's up it's not going back down definitely got a defective one and what i put in my water line is gone already and i know it's gone because my eye is starting to water <laughs> but that's my ipsy bag for september september so this is like next month will be my first full year of Ipsy. I'm excited. I don't have all my Ipsy bags. My daughter, whenever she needs a bag or whenever my sister needs a bag or anybody needs a bag, they come and they get bags for me, which is perfectly fine with me. I have plenty. So between this and my lip monthly, I have plenty. I liked it when um, Sephora did that one that looked like an envelope and it snapped really enjoyed that one kept that one nobody's getting that one um but um that's my video for as far as the ipsy part of my video now if you don't want to hear about my water challenge this is the time to exit out but i am still maintaining my water i'm getting in a gallon every day and um i'm feeling pretty good pretty good with it um 
I don't know. I think my skin is starting to feel or look like it has more hydration to it. I don't know. But I feel like it is. But I don't know. Um, my hair, I never know because I color it so much. Um, but, uh, yeah. I, it's going good. Weight's hanging in there where it needs to be. Not getting too high. Not getting too low that the doctors are going to scream. So, definitely... Um, doing good with the water challenge. Um, that's about all I can say about it. I'm doing good and December is getting here quick and that's the end of it. So we're going to see, you know, how I feel once I go back off of it and I'm not pushing the water so much. I mean, I'm going to still drink my water. Don't get me wrong. I'm going to still drink my water, but I'm not going to stress over whether I get that whole gallon in every day and then we'll see how I feel or if my body starts to crave that water because I heard that once you've done done this challenge your body will just crave that water you'll just want water so we're gonna see how that goes so that's my video for today I hope you guys enjoyed it um please like subscribe comment below let me know what you think about the new hair because I'm not sure how I feel about it yet <laughs> All right, guys, thanks so much for coming along. I appreciate all of you. I love all of you. And we'll see you again Thursday. No, today's Thursday. Tuesday, if not sooner. All right, guys, have a good one. Bye.